This series is garbage. Imagine trying to tell a whole nation that their heritage is wrong and then criticizing them when they rightly call you out for it. And in this video, I'm going to tell you about how you can turn a great story and history into garbage by adding an agenda, changing history, and actors who don't deserve to be in a great story and history like that. But in the beginning, for those who do not know the story of this series, I will tell you about it. What's the story? In 51 BC, Queen Cleopatra begins her reign as Queen of Egypt and the last of the Ptolemaic dynasty. But as students of history may know, her life will hardly be a peaceful one. Using historical facts related by classic scholars with live-action reenactments of events from Cleopatra's life starring Adele James, this documentary series presents a retelling of Cleopatra's notorious saga. As warriors, queens, mothers of nations. How can you turn a great story into garbage? This series is one of the worst works that I have watched. There are a lot of works and I have my own list. In the beginning, Queen Cleopatra. Yes, it's the worst work I have watched in my life. In second, the worst series I watched, for me, is The Witcher. Blood Origin. It is also produced by Netflix. And in third place is The Wheel of Time. And in fourth place is The Ring of Power. There are common factors between these series. I feel sometimes that it's stupid to put these factors inside any movie or series because the most beautiful thing in any work is be real. But when you put the agenda, everything becomes garbage. Now I will tell you how you can turn a great idea into garbage. I hope anyone who works in production such as Netflix, HBO, Amazon, Apple, to focus on my words because we as lovers of the world of movies and series, we are tired of this topic and how a world like the world of Tolkien turns into a farce like the Ring of Power. So please pay attention to what I will say, one. The agenda, yes, the worst thing, is that Netflix put their own agenda. Even if the agenda is good and supports the rights of a certain group, if the agenda changes the facts, the work as a whole is garbage. For example, in the series Vikings, Valhalla there was a character with black skin called Jarl Hakon. But if we think about the logic, about whether Vikings have black skin, I understand the principle that it is to defend the rights of black people. But does this thing support the story? No. Just an agenda that changes the identity of the work and the series becomes garbage. 2. Weak actors. Sometimes there are works based on only one character. And if this character ends, the work becomes from great to normal work. And the biggest example is Tommy Shelby is a great character. Imagine with me Peaky Blinders without Tommy Shelby. So I wish there was a strong personality in Queen Cleopatra. But unfortunately there is no. The last point is not to manipulate history, because there is great discontent from the Egyptian people and archaeologists. Because when you falsify the history of a people you only erase their traditions. Imagine with me that we are watching a documentary about sharks, and the movie wants to tell us that sharks live in the desert, and they love winter, and when spring comes, they fly in the sky. The same thing Netflix did with Queen Cleopatra. As I said at the beginning of the video, imagine trying to tell a whole nation that their heritage is wrong and then criticizing them when they rightly call you out for it. I have a request. I wish with all my heart that you subscribe to the channel. We get tired of writing scripts and editing videos, but we do not get views. But I will continue to download videos because I love what I do. But if I subscribe to that channel, I will be very happy. Is it any good? I would say that the storytelling by the people who were being interviewed was pretty good because the story was told to us in four episodes that were each around 40 minutes long. This is an extremely digestible amount of time and something you can put on, get engrossed in, and leave feeling like you've learned something. I didn't know much about Cleopatra before entering the show, and I feel like I left the series knowing a lot more about her than when I started, and actually thinking that she was a pretty cool historical figure. So it did something right. As I imagine that's the intention of the show. It's just a shame that the way that this show was executed it didn't complement the history and the story completely. As you can see, there weren't many good things about the show. I think that the most beautiful part when watching a movie is discussing the topic with other people, 
So tell me what you think about Queen Cleopatra. What did you like about the show? And what did you hate about the show? And how much do you give the show out of 10? I will tell you in my rate at the end of the video. Is it any week? I tried looking for the budget for this show, but I was unable to find anything. However, I don't think it takes much to realize that there wasn't a lot of money that was put behind it. With scenes that were so obviously taken from something else, perhaps even some kind of stock footage, the incorporation of close-up shots, and other things, it made the show quite poor in terms of the viewing experience. In order to create this world and try to make it feel real to the viewer while watching, everything is extremely important, but instead, it looked like a low-budget attempt, and the set and the outfits that the cast members were wearing looked more like dress-up than believable authentic uniforms and outfits that people would have worn all the way back then. It felt like they went half in with the drama and half in with the documentary, which I think just made the whole show for like a half attempt and made the pacing feel a bit weird at times, but that's just my opinion. I think it would have been better if it was just a straight documentary, or if they invested time and money into it, and did it like they did the Dharma show. What is my rate? In the end, I don't advise you to watch Queen Cleopatra. You will fake history and some bad character, and you will waste four hours of your time. In general, it is a garbage show, and I don't advise you to watch it. My rating is 1 out of 10. So we got to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Tell me how much do you rating the movie?